Oh, did she just attack your lips? You better not be a player of messing with my heart like this. All right, so hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today by the title, we're doing another episode. Guys, I, oh, I was gonna say something else. I got totally distracted. I was gonna say this is the last episode, but I was gonna, I, um, my brain isn't working. Um, we're gonna see who picks who and what happens and all that. So let's just jump into it and see the tea for today. All right. Oh yeah, they were kissing the little bitches. Colt, Madison, Lilith, what are you doing? This is not what it looks like. Oh, did she just attack your lips? Actually, that's probably exactly what happened. I'm not even, yeah. Oh please, this is exactly what it looks like. As I said before, it was only a matter of time before he came running to my bed. Right, because he would do that outside of our bedroom. That makes so much sense. Trash, like, you can never keep a man of this caliber. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're calling me trash. You're calling me trash, but you're the one who just kissed someone else's man. Like, you're like fast food, whereas I'm Michelin star meal, fit to feast upon Michelin star. Like, the frozen dinners you warm up. Right. Okay. All right. And boy, has he been feasting. Right, okay. What are you talking about? Darling, she's caught us now. We may as well come clean. <laughs> I can already tell that he's not into you. Like, girl, you're crazy. Come clean about what? About the fact we've been hooking up the entire time. What? We have not? We don't have to keep it a secret anymore. <laughs> he looks like he wants to push you and puke on you at the same time. Get off me. There's nothing to keep secret. Oh, he said back off. Yep. And there's nothing between us. Madison, you don't believe her, do you? I, I'm, I'm I'm just confused. She told him to me. She said her contact lens was stuck in her eyelid and she needed help. What? She's actually crazy, okay. Then as soon as you turned the corner, she pulled me in and kissed me. That's the best lie you could come up with. I don't even wear contact lenses. Well, how was he supposed to know that, crazy? You're the only one lying, Lola. Madison, I swear I would never. You know you're the only girl for me. She's trying to come between us. She's always out for drama. And if you don't believe me, then we can go see a producer. There's footage of everything we do here. There are cameras all around that will show us the truth. Please, say you believe me. Cole has never lied to me before and I know he's not lying now. I have to let him know. I try. I trust, I don't think he's a player, guys. I really don't think he wants to go hook up with Lilith. I actually think she's crazy. And I trust him. I don't need proof, yeah. I believe you, Colt. I don't need any proof other than your word. Yeah, take that, Lilith. Imagine if he is playing us, though. That's gonna be embarrassing. Yeah, thank you. It means so much to me that you can trust me. He places his hand on your waist for a moment before rounding on Lilith. And you. I thought you were in pain. I wanted to help you, but I should have known better. If you reach out to a snake, you've only gotten yourself to blame when you get bitten. Did he just call me a snake? Uh, yeah, he did. Okay, take it personally. <laughs> I would call you much worse, but we're on national television. So instead, I'll give you a clear warning. This is me being courteous. This is me with my temper contained. But if you try and come between Madison and me again, there will be consequences. Oh, period. That is my man. Don't mess with him, girl, okay? Are you threatening me? I'm warning you. I love this woman. Oh, mm-hmm. I will fight for her no matter the target, no matter the cost. Considering how big your head is, I hope you have enough space to remember this. <laughs> because I do not enjoy repeating myself. Oh. See, now get you a coat, y'all. He interlocks his fingers with yours as he pulls you away. You look back over your shoulder, seeing Lilith silently seething. Wow, you really told her off. I'm sick of her bullshit. All she does is needle and probe, trying to come between us. And why? She doesn't want to be with me. She's just looking for someone who will secure her future financially. She's the definition of a gold digger and have a radar for girls like her. Oh, period, boo, as you should. <laughs> oh yeah, you've had a lot of gold diggers in your life? A few who thought they could try their luck, but I'm not interested in anyone who doesn't want to be with me for me. Like. You, you see me, the good, the bad, the ugly. Yeah, we do. There is no ugly when it comes to you. My temper can be a bit ugly, which you probably saw back there with Lilith. You were just defending me, defending us. You've been patient and Lilith is persistent. Like you said, she needles away. I'm just glad we're okay. That's all that matters to me. Yeah, we're, we're okay. I'm glad I have your trust, always. Oh, okay guys, okay. Madison, Summer? Oh, thank God you're here. I need your help. I'll leave you two ladies alone. Want me to make you both some breakfast? Both of us? Yeah, unless you're not hungry. Oh, oh no, I am, it's just, you're not my partner. Yeah, but you're Madison's friend, which makes you my friend. <laughs> guys, he's so cute. 
cute and nice. <laughs> Thank you, that would be great. Okay, I'll call you when it's ready. He dips a kiss onto your cheek before he leaves. So what's the crisis? You guys are such goals. Summer? Sorry. So I've been thinking a lot about what Lilith said about how I'm playing Jane and I told you she was lying. She just wants to. She's not wrong though, is she? Yes, she is. Okay, have you seen her? I'm the least memorable girl in the house. That's why I've decided I wanna dye my hair. You wanna dye your hair? Yes. I've always wanted to, but I've never had the guts to. But being here, becoming friends with you, I feel like I finally figured out that I deserve a lot more than I usually give myself. And I guess I'm just nervous about getting stuck with a player during the recoupling. I'm nervous about being everyone's last pick. That's why I want to do this now, before the ceremony. I want to know that I gave being on the show my best shot. That's so cool. I love this for you, Summer. So will you help me dye my hair? I've never done it before and I don't even know where to start. If you want, you could dye yours too. There are a lot of amazing looks you can try. OMG, this sounds super fun. I won't help you. Uh, just, it'll be less boring. Let's, uh, I'll help you dye your hair. I, yeah, let's, yeah, I'll help you dye. I don't want to dye my hair. Let's dye hers. Of course I'll help you. Let's go. Thank you so much. This is going to look amazing. I can't wait for the transformation. Nobody will ever be able to call you Clean Jane after this again. What color should, okay, let's see. We got the double... Uh, let's try a different one. Okay, blue. Okay. Ooh, okay, let's go with this one. Yep, she just, yeah. Okay, I'm done. What do you think? I love it. Oh, she looks cute, you guys. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. You're totally welcome. It looks amazing. Aww. Later that day, you start getting ready for the recoupling. Uh oh, I thought he was gonna strip naked for a second. What are you wearing? I haven't decided yet. Can I see the options? Sure thing. Okay, we got that. Okay, I think we'll go with the red, yeah. I like that one. You look beautiful. You ready for recoupling? I'm glad I have first pick. Now I just need to decide who I want to be with. Ha ha ha, very funny, Colt. Hey, mister, you're mine. Yes, I definitely am. I want you, only you, and I want you. Come on, we better get to the studio or we'll be in trouble. And we're on in three, two, one. Good evening and welcome to Don't Hate the Player, where tonight we are recoupling. And as you know, for our previous challenge, Colt has first pick. And I know we're all dying to see who his choice will be. Will he stick with Madison? Will their whirlwind romance continue? I know that's the question our viewers all want answered. So Colt, the floor is yours. What's your decision? I... I feel like he's like, he hesitates. Why are you hesitating? Bitch, no. I want Madison, but, but what? There's not a but? I'm sorry, hold on, but? Oh, gasp, yeah, <gasps> is right. What's going on? Do we have some drama? Let the boy finish, Colt, you were saying? I was saying, I love Madison. I want her more than I have ever wanted anything, but I want her on her own terms. I don't want to pick her if she doesn't want to be coupled with me. We do want to be coupled with you though. What? If she has any doubts, then I want her to be free to be with who she wants. So I guess before I choose, I have to ask. Madison, do you want me to pick you? All the cameras turn to you, the eyes of the world watching, waiting for your response. How are you gonna put us on the spot like that when we literally have told you so many times? How much reassurance do you need, boy? Oh my God. Even the hosts seem to be holding their breaths. I want to be with Cole and I'm going to sh get, show him with a passionate kiss. Say yes, roll your eyes. Say you don't care. Honestly, like I don't care because the fact that you even had to ask me that. Like, rude. No, I'm just kidding. I'll give him a kiss. Oh, guys, we're meant to be. You grab his face, kissing him passionately in front of the entire world. He better not be a player of messing with my heart like this. Does this answer your question? He picks you up, taking control of your kiss as he returns your embrace passionately. Yes, ma'am. Guys, <laughs> this is a live show, you know. Back in line, Madison, and let's re continue recoupling. As you return to the line of girls, Colt should do a cheeky wink and you... I should wink back, smile, blow kiss. I'll wink back, sure. The rest of the house couples up again and you breathe a sigh of relief. Now that our couples are all done, it's back to the villa for another week of sniffing out the players. Remember, ladies, the clock is ticking and the next elimination is only a few days away, so be sure to keep your eyes open. Back in your room, you start to get ready for bed. Oof, what's wrong? Nothing. I just think my body is starting to relax a little. I always feel so tense during the recoupling, especially tonight when I wasn't the one picking. He crosses the room, placing his hand on your waist as he whispers into your ear. You shouldn't have felt tense. I told you, there's only you for me. Nobody else. You relax a little more under his touch. Yikes, you do feel tense. I can feel your back all locked up. My shoulders too. You sigh, slumping onto the bed. Take off your robe. Ah, excuse me. What? Why? I'm gonna help you loosen up. Mm, okay. What do you have in mind? You shoot him a flirty wink and I shoot myself in an uncomfortable everything, yeah. I'm thinking a sensual massage will make you feel better. Perhaps if you're relaxed after that, you can show me how limber you are. Um, no. That sounds perfect. I have to pay for this too? Snap at him to get away from you? Mm, honestly, like kind of, yeah. But I guess. Guys, why can't it just be like, no, you refuse, you know? Oh my God, I guess. How's the pressure? Mm -mm, feels good, yeah. Yikes, your back is full of knots. 
Hold on a moment. I'm gonna try and loosen you up. Okay. Oh, whoa. Okay. How's that? He's like really okay. Good. All of you loosen limber in no time. You let go and lose yourself in his touch. Any walls you had still falling away as he works out your knots. He leans in and slides your robe down your back, planting a soft kiss on your shoulder blade, then the other. You roll over to face him and look deep into the eyes of the man you're falling for until you can't hold back any longer and kiss him everywhere. Okay the next day. Good morning, couples. Today we have your final challenge before the elimination, and today's prize is one of the best we've ever offered. That's right, the winner of today's challenge will get to spend the day on a luxury yacht. Unlimited gourmet food, vintage champagne, hot tub, sun decks, it's a dream date. But if you wanna win it, you better show us how stable you are. How stable? What does that even mean? All will be revealed, but first, wardrobe. Your stylist will meet you. You wait for Hermione to return with clothing when you hear the door open. Oh, 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 hi. Hello, all of a sudden, I like cowboys. Hi. Hey there, little lady. Ooh. Okay, no, absolutely not. That's what we're not gonna do. Oh my God, you're a cowboy. I am. I guess that's the theme of this challenge. Maybe horse riding. Are you riding too? No idea yet, but at least I look the part. You look cute, hot, sexy. You look hot. <laughs> so hot. Why, thank you. Can't wait to see what you look like in your getup. No waiting necessary. I have a collection here. The perfect outfits to save a horse and ride a cowboy. Hermione! What? Come on, that joke was too easy. Now let's try on some clothes. Okay, we got that. That one. Okay, I feel like the pants are more... Okay, that's cute. I think the dress, even though it's probably gonna be a horror... Actually, let's go with the shorts. Let's go with this, yeah. You look amazing. Beyond amazing, this is exactly what she needs to win this challenge, trust me. <laughs> I'm gonna pay for it, no question. Because look what happened last time I didn't pay for it, now I'm scared. Okay, let's match. Okay, let's get back out there. Hello, contestants. You all look country-tastic. Perfect for this challenge. Are we riding a horse? Close. Oh God, it's bucking Bronco. What? Ha, again close. There is no mechanical bull, I am afraid. Instead, what you have to do is beat the banana. What? What does that even mean? Beat the what now? We all heard that, right? I beg your pardon? Did she just say what I think she said? I did, allow me to demonstrate. I'm just, oh. Guys, what the hell? Today's challenge is to stay on the mechanical banana as long as possible. Boys and girls will each have their turn. Whoever can stay on the longest without being thrown off will win the date. So beat the banana and ride the longest to walk away victorious. Bring it on. Oh yeah, this challenge is gonna be hilarious. I have all the skills to beat this banana. Sure you do, Lilith. I will not be unseated. Worried? No. But I mean, just once it would be great to have a normal challenge. Yeah. Instead of riding a giant banana. Who even comes up with these ideas? Whoever thinks of these ideas is a creative genius. This is the weirdest thing ever, but okay. I'm first up and ready to ride. This isn't so bad. Okay. Oh, whoa, it's faster. <laughs> Guys, I'm not even gonna, I'm not saying anything. OMG. Oh my God, she lost a top again? Not again. Again, seriously? Right in front of the cactus? My turn. Okay, right. Oh, he got knocked off too. Everyone got knocked off. Oh, he didn't even get a chance. My boys! Ooh. Okay, time to show them how it's done. Oh, okay. Oh, I got this. No, you don't. No, you don't. I don't got this. Mm -mm. It's way harder than it looks. Hopefully Madison can pull through and get us the win. We're gonna take a quick commercial break, but we'll be right back with Don't Hate the Player. Stay tuned to see which one of our players will beat the banana and which one will lose their heads. Okay, everyone, take five and we'll be back. I'm gonna run to the bathroom. Okay, see you soon. Okay. Girl. Hello? Let me out! What was that? Sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of me winning the next challenge. Bitch. She wants to play dirty? Okay. Lilith! She's locked me in. I'm gonna miss my turn. Oh my god. Don't hit. Guys, will you make it out of the bathroom in time for the challenge? Keep it. Oh my god, you guys. I cannot. This crazy bitch. She's actually psycho. Y'all, I cannot believe this. Guys, that was that episode. That was a quick one, that was a very fast one. I can't believe she, actually I can't believe she locked us in there cause she's crazy. But guys, I hope you guys liked it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you like me, subscribe down below. I love y'all, don't forget to love yourself. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace out, scouts. Bye.